In a recent press release by the Internal Revenue Commission, IRC Commissioner General Sam Koim slammed logging companies for stealing from PNG's forests. He says the companies are evading taxes by under-declaring their real incomes. Acnow PNG manager Eddie Tanago says the analysis by IRC is alarming and has made a call to the Forest Authority to stop issuing new logging permits and extensions for these companies. For too long, the PNG Forest Authority has failed to properly monitor the logging industry and has ignored the illegal and unsustainable logging practices, including the controversial special agriculture business leases that was deemed illegal by a commission of inquiry. The IRC says it is currently auditing 20 foreign-owned logging companies and expects to be laying criminal charges. However, there needs to be better monitoring. Koim says when Quila logs are exported from PNG to China, the value declared by the logging company might be around 110 US dollar. But the logging company is not selling the logs directly to the buyer in China. He explained that the company sells the logging to one of its own overseas subsidiaries. That associated company then on sells the logs to China for a much higher price. The offshore company then pockets the price difference, depriving PNG of taxes and royalties and allowing the company to claim a loss on its local operations. Acnow PNG says the government must step in and stop granting more logging permits or permit extensions until and unless the company involved has been given a clean bill of health by the Internal Revenue Commission.